Hello everybody, welcome back to another vlog. You can probably hear Drew vacuuming in the background and in typical time blindness fashion. It is 3.36, our friends will be here at four o'clock. <laughs> I'm just finishing up my work for the day. I'm gonna do like a super quick makeup look, you know, very, very fast. And we are gonna have like a fun little friends night out together. It's gonna be a blast. So we're just like gonna go to a couple little spots, I think, and then just kind of like see where the night takes us. Uh, a dink night, if you will. I heard someone refer to me as that recently, and I always heard Jenna and Julian, Jenna Marbles, back in the day, um, call themselves that, and I thought it was just like a cute nickname, but it actually stands for double income, no kids, or dual income, no kids, or something like that. And I just thought that was funny. So that is what we were gonna be doing. If you didn't know, Noelle is one of my friends from high school in Tennessee. She moved here to LA. Like, actually, she and her husband, Josh, they moved here like a month before we did in 2019 and then they've been here ever since we obviously left for two years but anywho we love hanging out with them we haven't caught up with them in a while because we've all been busy so since you last saw me drew did end up getting a little bit of like a disney cold and his mom actually ended up getting sick too um sadly but luckily she's feeling much better and drew wasn't sick for very long he was it was like very temporary and i actually somehow never ended up getting sick I have no idea how this happened, but I avoided it. I hope that vacuum isn't too loud in the background. But anyways, before I get uh, like too far into this, it was reminding me when I was like setting up my camera to film this vlog clip that actually a few months ago, maybe back in April, um, we were hanging out with our same friends that we're hanging out with tonight and I vlogged it and that was like right around the time that I kind of stopped vlogging. <laughs> So I have this footage, so I thought I might as well, you know, show it to you because it's fun and I want it to live on my channel. So here's some of that and then we'll come back into current day. Hello everybody, welcome back to another vlog. It's Sunday, the day I'm filming this, and we had a fun little morning at the farmer's market. We walked and got coffee, it was great. And I thought I would show you the few things that we got at the farmer's market. Drew ordered groceries for this week, so that will be arriving soon, but the first thing- You for me. Drew is not um, amused by some of the comments on my past grocery haul, he's defensive. But anyways, the first thing we got at the farmer's market was this beautiful bouquet of flowers. It's so pretty. We made sure that there were no lilies in this one because some of the other ones had lilies, but like, look how pretty. It looks like wildflowers almost. I love the colors. It's like yellow, orange, pink, purple, white. Love it. I love this color also. <laughs> he's colorblind in case you didn't know. We got a loaf of bread from Lodge Bread and this is called the Country Loaf. And this looks so freaking good. Um, there were a lot of different ones, but we chose this one, so it's just like a good crusty bread to have like avocado toast with, sandwiches, etc. So we got that. We got some radishes. Drew is a radish girly. He loves his radishes. He just eats them. We saw on TikTok that a lot of like French people slash maybe a lot of other European countries, they'll do like butter and salt on top of a radish and it's like his favorite thing ever. So did that. It's got a couple Persian cucumbers. These are so cute. I'm obsessed with eating sliced cucumbers, Dubliner cheese and cashews together. Like it's my favorite combo. And then, oh my gosh, if you're from California, you know. Jerry's berries are bad. Harry. <laughs> Harry's berries are the best strawberries I've ever had in my entire life. I just realized my sunglasses are still on. Whatever, I'm sweating. I don't want you to see my face. Um, these are so good. And last time they were really, really tiny, but this year they're like huge and they're so red. They smell unbelievable. So I'll probably be having some of those momentarily. Then we got Oh, we stopped by Whole Foods on the way home and got some butter because we just needed butter. And then the last thing we got was from this stall called Krusty's and they have the best pot pies and banana pudding that we've ever had. So we got three. These are for Drew. He eats these for lunch during the week. We got three of these curry chicken pot pies. They're so delicious. And then we also got one of the regular 
chicken pot pies, I think, for me. Oh my god, it's amazing. And then we did get two of the banana pudding, which we haven't had this since like last summer probably, right? So good. It is so good. And the guy that's always there is so nice to us. But it is the best banana pudding ever. I even like it better than like Magnolia Bakery, I think. Oh my god, Moo is screaming in the other room instead of just coming out to see us. So anyway, that's our farmer's market haul. We have a little bit of a gap in time, so we're gonna just like shower. I might throw on a little fake tan, we'll see. And then we're meeting up with our friends Josh and Noel later because we have not seen them since we got back from Japan. Here's our beautiful bouquet in action. It looks gorgeous. We went for like a longer arrangement today, why not? And I just made this unbelievably glorious avocado toast with avocado, salt, pepper, everything but the bagel seasoning, hot honey on the farmer's market loaf, and then with some farmer's market radishes. Ugh, it's gonna be so good. All right, so a few hours later, I realized that lately my vlogs have been like, hey, I'm about to go do this thing. And then I go do it and then I come back and then it's the same thing all over again. <laughs> but we're getting ready to head to dinner. I ran out of time. So this is what my hair looks like, but it doesn't look bad or anything. Um, and then I'm gonna just put on some white cowboy boots, these little tiny ones. This thrifted dress I got um, at this thrift store in LA I did for a main channel video. We've decided on a plan with our friends who are going to be here any second now need to grab some sunglasses and then maybe even like a light jacket oh and i need to put my lipstick on adhd time blindness will never fail like no matter what i've been sitting on the couch for the last like three hours no matter what time i need to be out the door i will be scrambling <laughs> no matter how much time you give me it will be chaos up until that point i think i'm gonna go with these classic square sunglasses and then just a leather jacket here's a look at the fit oh i hear our friends let's go <laughs> Hello! myself vlogging after two drinks. I hate it. I hate it. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to hold up my camera more because I vlog like this when I'm in public because I get nervous. So um, everything was good. I everything was good. I tried my first beef tartare. It was actually delicious. It was in like Let's a crispy taco. Oh. I don't want to go upstairs. <laughs> we feel very fancy right now. So yeah, if you're um, in the Beverly Hills area, if you're visiting or if you live around here, check out the hideaway. It was really good. So I think we're gonna pick up a bottle of wine and then, oh, we can get our nails done here and all. <laughs> Perfect. It's probably so expensive. <laughs> and I think we're just gonna do like a little um, patio hang. So that's gonna be the vibe for the rest of the night. Patio, patio mode, patio mode. <laughs> So it was such a lovely evening. We just finished up with our friends. It's like 8 p.m. now, and we just had some drinks on the patio, relaxed a bit, and now we are turning in for the night. So I think I'm gonna change into my pajamas. Well, I kinda need to shower off this fake tan, um, so I might do that. Good night. Here's my green eyeshadow. Goodbye. All right, now we're back, and I am just gonna very quickly do a makeup look and get dressed, and then our friends are gonna meet us here. I think we might have a drink out on our patio. It is 
very hot today though like very very hot it's like 90 degrees in la which if you watch my last vlog you'll know like i don't know it's just something about southern california heat is so much hotter i don't know if it's like the humidity or what it is but oh my god seriously so crazy i was gonna try to do this in more of like a get ready with me style but um number one i use the same products like every single day when i get ready and number two i don't really have a lot of time for that anyway i had a nice productive day i've been trying like early in the morning well not early early but like in the mornings i've been trying to go walking and i just like enjoy my morning walks so much i just put on my big headphones and i like listen to a podcast or listen to music and just zone out and it's really nice i've been listening to this podcast i think it was recommended maybe i can't remember or if i just like found it i think someone recommended it to me but it's called the teacher's pet and i think the podcast itself is like three years old but i just recently discovered it and it's really good it's about like a woman who went missing in australia and like how her husband is sort of at like the center of the investigation and it's very suspicious and like right before she went missing he was having an affair with one of his students is a high school teacher and like whoa very messy i'm only like three or four episodes in so far so don't give me any spoilers i think i already did see one but anyway i'm just gonna try to like not be spoiled as much as i can but yeah i've been listening to that that's been really good i've really enjoyed that so far and yeah i just finished up some work for the day and now we're gonna let loose it's a thursday and then like this weekend I'm, i think i'm gonna really try to chill as much as possible because next week is gonna be very busy so i have alexa's birthday coming up um next week and we're gonna just like make a little staycation out of it we're gonna get like a hotel and just chill kind of like a little mini girls trip and then after that at the day she leaves actually my dad and my brother come to town so that'll be nice and then actually while my dad and my brother are in town i will be going to my second of the eras tour shows which i am so excited about i'm going to night two in la or night three i can't remember which one and i am like so excited to see the eras tour again and drew's coming with me so he's like obviously beside himself with excitement it's his first time seeing taylor all right i need to finish this eyeliner and put on my mascara and then we will reconvene and i'm gonna get dressed and then we're gonna head out hey honey hi how are you all right got myself ready chatted on the phone with my dad and i'm so sad because i just went to get dressed i was gonna wear this like cute little outfit with one of my shirts that i thrifted when i was in london and it has a hole in it i didn't know when i bought it or i don't know if this is like since i bought it but it literally has a freaking hole Ugh. i was gonna wear this cute little shirt with like some sambas but i guess I'll do something else. Hold, please. Well, this isn't fully what I planned on wearing, but I just threw on a tube top. My necklaces are from Walmart, actually. My earrings, I think I got on Amazon a while ago. Same with my sunglasses. These dad shorts are from Abercrombie, and then I got my white sambas. I'm still kind of trying to break these in. They kind of hurt on my back of, like, my ankle, which is weird, because I bought black ones, and they were totally fine, so I don't know. Our friends are going to be here in about 10 minutes, so I actually made pretty decent time. I'm also also just like loving how easy it is to style my short hair by the way it's just so much easier and it reminds me of like this is probably the same length that i cut it to back in like 2018 maybe oh it's just so nice for summer so if you've been like kind of considering cutting your hair maybe this should be your sign because it's so much fun It's the next day, it's just before 8 a.m. and I'm headed out to go meet Macy for a little coffee date. I think her sister Lexi will be there as well, so I'm very excited. I haven't seen them, oh my god, like in like a month. This summer has just been so busy for everyone. So yeah, it's gonna be really good to catch up and I have been walking every single morning and listening. I think I talked about it yesterday, listening to my podcast called The Teacher's Pet. So that's what I'm gonna do. I have about like 30 minutes to kill. So I think I'm just gonna like walk around a little bit and then go meet up with Macy and Lexi and have a nice little coffee date. It's gonna be really fun. Oh, my headphones were disconnecting. All right, let's do this. Oh my 
I got spotted. All right, it is much later now. It's like almost 3 p.m. We just finished Layla's little like afternoon routine, did a little walk. It's not as hot today as it has been, which is very, very nice. I had such a good morning with Macy and Lexi. It was so good to catch up with them as usual. I always forget to vlog when I'm hanging with my friends, but we ended up coming back to my place for a little while and we hung out. The girls were like loving on Layla so much and she loved having the girl time. It was so, so cute. They were both like petting her and she was in heaven. And I'm just so grateful for friends like Macy and like Lexi, Josh and Noel, who we saw last night. Like it's just been, my heart is very full, like friendship wise. I feel very happy and I have more friend plans next week. I have family coming. It's gonna be really fun. Oh, there's Layla right there. <laughs> She's hanging out by her dad's office cause she loves him. She's guarding him. But yeah, I'm actually running a bath right now. You can probably hear in the background and I'm just gonna take a nice relaxing bath. I have one lush bath bomb left. That's how many bath bombs I got for Christmas and my birthday this year. I got so many that it is literally almost August and literally I'm using my last bath bomb. So that's how many I've had left. So I'm just gonna relax. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. It was kind of like a mishmash of a bunch of different things put together. Old footage, new footage, random stuff. I hope you enjoyed it nonetheless. And I think we're just gonna have a nice chill, relaxing weekend. And maybe like go on some walks, get some coffee, go to the farmer's market, the usual. So I am going to kick that off. It's Friday right now. I'm going to kick that off with a little bath and maybe play my Switch or something. That just sounds very relaxing. So thanks so much for watching and I'll see you very soon in the next vlog. Bye. Say bye bye, sweet girl. Say bye, everybody. Oh, you're drooling a little bit. <laughs>